Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'll be reviewing Friday the 13th from Crystal Lake to Manhattan. This is the Friday the 13th DVD box set, including the original eight Friday the 13th films, the original eight from Paramount. And uh, this box set is the box set I was looking for because I didn't really like Jason Goes to Hell and Jason X and all them other ones. I'm sorry, I didn't. But I love the original eight Friday the 13th films. Part 1 to Jason Takes Manhattan, which is what this set includes. Friday the 13th to Friday the 13th Part 8 to Jason Takes Manhattan. And um, this set came out in 2004. So this was before the Deluxe Edition DVDs. I do realize they made a Deluxe Edition box set, but I didn't really get that one. But uh, here is um, the box set. Here's the back. Here's some uh, special features, but there is an extra DVD for that. Eight films, five discs, no mercy. Um, yeah, this is, um, this is a very good set. I like this set, and um, this set's actually gotten bad reviews because, you know, there's no uncut versions of any of the films. There's a... Uh, no 3D version of uh, Part 3, which a lot of people just are like, yeah, this box set isn't that great, but I think it's pretty good. Um, so here are the DVDs. I'm going to take those out, and I will review them. I'm going to put this set over here. Let me just organize the DVDs. So, yeah, this is... Um, here are the rest of the DVDs. I'll go over here. So here's the original Friday the 13th. Um, Friday the 13th Part 1. I really liked this film. I thought it was good. Um, and this one does not have Jason in it. Because Jason wasn't really um, thought to be the killer. But then that changes in Part 2. And so uh, Jason does become the killer for the series, but uh, Friday the 13th Part 1, really good movie, I liked it. Here's Friday the 13th Part 2, I really like this movie a lot too. Um, I would even say I liked it better than the first one, but uh, in my opinion at least, but I really do like this film, this is the first film that introduces us to Jason as the killer, so um, yeah, I mean, Jason doesn't have the hockey mask, but don't worry, he will, and um, here's the back. And here's the inside. There's the disc. Yeah, there's uh, two movies on one disc. There's Jason. Okay, so... Wait, hang on. Let me move these. Alright, here is Friday the 13th Part 3 and Friday the 13th Part 4, the final chapter. Part 3, I really enjoyed this one too. I liked it a lot. And then here's Friday the 13th Part 4, the final chapter. A lot of people say this is their favorite one of the series, which I can understand because I do think it is a good movie. Um, so, you know, you, you know, this was intended to be the final one, and um, they didn't really want to do that because Jason um, had such a popular fan base, and, you know, they realized this movie did really good, so they're like, let's make more. And um, luckily, they did not end it here. Uh, here's the back. And here is the disc. Friday the 13th, part 3, and Friday the 13th, the final chapter. Yeah. And then we have Friday the 13th, part 5, A New Beginning, and Friday the 13th, part 6, Jason Lives. Friday the 13th, part 5, A New Beginning. Uh, I didn't really like this one too much. Um, I don't know, man. I, I didn't really like this movie. So, uh, this would probably be my least favorite of the original Paramount 8, but it's not my least favorite of the series, just the, my least favorite of the original Paramount 8. Um, this movie has its good moments, but, uh, you know, I didn't really like this movie too much. Um... And then here's Friday the 13th Part 6 of Jason Lives. This is my second favorite of the entire series. I really like this film. It's uh, entertaining, it's funny, and it's just all around a good movie, in my opinion. Here's the back. And let me show you the inside. 
here is Jason. And then here is Friday the 13th Part 7, The New Blood, and Friday the 13th Part 8, Jason Takes Manhattan. Friday the 13th Part 7, The New Blood, I know um, I share a very unpopular opinion, but this one is my personal favorite of the entire Friday the 13th series, because this was my very first Friday the 13th film I ever saw, and, you know, um, re-watching it years later, I realize it is awesome. So... I'm really glad that I was able to sit down and watch this movie for the first time a couple years ago, and I just really enjoyed it. So there, you know, I thought it was a good movie. Then we have Friday the 13th Part 8, Jason Takes Manhattan, one of my favorites. This one is really fun to watch, and I always have a good time uh, watching this movie. So, you know, I really liked it. Here's the back. And, uh... Here's the inside of it. And then, here's the final DVD of the box set, Friday the 13th Killer Extras. These are all the special features of the movies. This includes Friday the 13th Chronicles, a part featurette, Secrets Galore Behind the Gore, a three part featurette, Crystal Lake Victims Tell All, Tales from the Cuttering Room Floor, Friday Artifacts and Collectibles, and Scary Trailers. Here is the disc, and here are all the special features again. And that is the Friday the 13th box sets from Crystal Lake to Manhattan. Oh, wow, I thought this was an awesome box set. I um, sat down the other night to watch these films. I uh, had a good time watching them. And I think this is just a great, great box set. Um, I think every Friday the 13th fan should get this. I know there's a Blu-ray box set, but I don't have a Blu-ray player. And I don't really like the way the, that it's laid out with, with the book thing. You have to pull the disc out. Same thing with the Deluxe Edition box set, too. Um, but the, these are good. You know, I, I like this set. Um, the DVDs come in really good quality and some good sound, and uh, the special features are good. Um, I also have the documentary to the Friday the 13th series, Crystal Lake Memories, the two disc collector's edition. But I will do a review on this for another day. So, um, yeah, I also got to do the collection update. These two items are a part of the collection update. Um, there's plenty of more items to show in the collection update, but um, these are two items out of, um, I think, six or five or six, or maybe even seven, I don't know. But there's like definitely five or more. But uh, very good box set. I love this set, and I think it's just really good. Um, thanks, guys, for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see all of you later. Bye.